Hi everyone. We're going to talk a little bit about cleaning and maintaining our warmers. Kelsey is going to do a great job at showing us how to properly clean them and to make sure that they are ready to receive food before for our guests. All right, the first thing she's going to do is make sure that the warmer itself is unplugged. It's ideal to make sure it's turned off as well, but the unplugging will make, ensure that uh, anything that happens to spill on the heat warmer itself, that uh, you know, you're know you safe, your safety is most important. The chemicals that you're gonna need is a sanitizer, and it's extremely important to make sure that it is food safe. This is where everybody's food is gonna be, and the last thing we wanna do is to, is to mix chemical with food to make somebody sick. All right, Kelsey has taken a few moments to go through the warmer and pick out any extra debris, like um, food that could have spilled or aluminum foil or anything that happened to come off um, while putting the pans in the warmer itself. She's using that food safe sanitizer to spray the back of the warmer down by the heating element, along the rails, the doors, and the racks. She's so gonna let the sanitizer sit on the warmer for a minimum of 60 seconds to ensure that she, it, to let the, the chemical remove any bacteria that's in there. Once she's finished, she's gonna take a clean, dry towel and start wiping from top to bottom. And she'll continue this process until the entire warmer has been wiped on the inside. It's important to spend a little time on the floor of the warmer, especially by the heating element. If food or any kind of paper gets on that, on that element, it could potentially be a fire hazard. So we'll make sure that she spends a little extra time with that. And while she finishes, as soon as she is finished with this, she'll close the doors and wipe down the outside of the warmer itself. Please let us know if you have any questions. We look forward to working with you.